Alright then gang, so oftentimes you might need to add icons to buttons using CSS when you don't have access to the HTML template itself, and you can do that easily by using the pseudo elements before and after. So in the HTML it's just two buttons, and these are the buttons we want to add icons to, each one has their own class which we can target in the CSS. In the CSS file we import the Google Materials icons library and we add some very basic styles to the buttons to make them purple, give them padding, some margin and a border radius. Alright, so to add the icons in, we can inject some extra content into the buttons using either the before or after pseudo elements. So I could target the button with the class of cart and then tack on the before pseudo elements. And inside that, I would make sure first of all that the font family is set to material icons, which is imported at the top of the file, remember. And then add a content property to output some content to the DOM. In our case, that would be the keyword of whatever icon we want to use. So for this button, we'll say add shopping cart. And that's going to inject the shopping cart icon instead of the actual text because we specify the material icons font family. I also like to make the icon a little bit bigger as well so we can say font size is set to 1.5 m's and then that's the first button done. Now I'm going to paste in some CSS now for the second button which does exactly the same thing but this time targets the login button and uses the login keyword for the icon. Also notice this time we use the after pseudo class selector meaning the icon appears after the text whereas on this button the icon is injected before the text. And now in the browser we can see those icons in the buttons but they don't look correctly aligned. So to combat that we can come to the selector targeting both the buttons and say display as flex and we can also align the item in the vertical direction to the center and specify a gap property of 8 pixels to put some space between the text and the icon. And now in a browser we can see that looks nice. So that my friends is how we can use only CSS to add icons to buttons.